Greetings, Pelican families. I am Dr. Janae Gilbert Collins, principal here at Port Wentworth Elementary School, and I have with me today Percy, our friendly Pelican mascot. I'd like to take this time to welcome you and your families to our school, as well as to our first virtual open house. We hope that this video will inform you of all the information that you would need to ease your anxieties and answer all your questions. Please also know that we've prepared a student-friendly video that we hope you share with your students, as well as each teacher will have a presentation available about class schedules and curriculum. This year at Port Wentworth Elementary, we have a new assistant principal, Dr. Joy Boyd. Dr. Boyd will introduce herself later on in our video. We also have a new administrative secretary, Ms. Karen Lambert, and Ms. Tasha Maxwell will continue to serve as our part-time secretary, as well as Ms. Laterica Young will remain our student information specialist. As part of Savannah Chatham County Public School System, our mission is to ignite a passion for learning and teaching at high levels. Our vision is from school to the world, all students prepared for productive futures. At Port Wentworth Elementary, we stand by our Pelican promise to ensure high levels of learning in a safe and inclusive environment which models and supports the development of lifelong skills. Here at Port Wentworth, we are a pre-K through second grade school with about 650 students. At Port Wentworth Elementary, we have some virtual class expectations for our students. I like to call these our four A's, area, attire, attitude, and attendance. Area, please help our scholars find a quiet work area around your home and have their supplies ready. Attire, Students should get up and get ready for school each day. Come to class dressed, ready to learn. Attitude, help us encourage them to try their best at all times. And attendance, students should be present and on time each day. Parents, it is vitally important for you to submit your lunch applications. The deadline is September 30th. This can be done in a contactless manner by going to www.sccpss.com and clicking the Family and Students tab. Look all the way to the right and you'll see School Nutrition. Under that is Free Reduced Lunch Application. Or you can go to www.myschoolapps.com. If you wish to complete a paper application, you can call our Operations Auxiliary Center on Hopkins Street to make an appointment to pick one up, and their number is 912-395-1066. Meals will be delivered to several stops around our district during virtual learning. Also, be on the lookout for a verification email that requires you to confirm you and your child's information. Be sure to read it all the way through because at the very bottom is an electronic code of conduct. I will continue to communicate with you weekly in our newsletter, Pelican Pride, providing you with all of the latest updates, our virtual spirit weeks, and everything that you'll need to know for the upcoming week. Port Wentworth families, we are here at our virtual tour. We are only a click away. So we will start off with what's the address to the school? Our address to Port Wentworth Elementary School is 507 South Coastal Highway, Port Wentworth, Georgia, 31407. We cannot wait to see you here face to face when it's safe to do so. So until then, our virtual world will give you all the information that you need. So if you're trying to get here for the first time at Port Wentworth Elementary School, if you have Google, which everybody does, here is, you can plug in your information, and here is how to get to our school. There's our map. 
What's the school's phone number and fax number? Our friendly staff will be ready to help you at our phone number, 912-395-6742. If you need to send us something, doctor excuses, important doctor, uh, documents, our fax machine is ready to accept that information as well. Our fax number is 912-965-6734. So let's take a virtual tour where you will be able to find a lot of Pelican pride. There's no place like our Port Wentworth website. This is where all of our families gather. While you're at home and you need some information, make sure you stop by our Port Wentworth Elementary School website. On this website, as you notice, we have lots of tabs. These tabs will help you get to where you need to be. If you want to contact us, one of our teachers, myself, Dr. Boyd, or our principal, Dr. Collins, here on the Contacts tab, you will see all of our staff directory. So if your child is in pre-K, kindergarten, first or second grade, everyone, including your administrators, are listed under the Contacts tab. If you click on the Home button, it will take you right back to our front page. We make many announcements on the front page here. We have flyers that we also um, put on the front page. Any information that you need here at Port Wentworth Elementary School, taking a virtual tour to our website will get you what you need. How do you stay informed beyond the teacher? Well, we have three different links. Parent school, power school, parent access is one. The district's website and the district's YouTube channel. So let's take a virtual tour. The power school parent access is located on the sccpss.com website. When you go to the website, up here at the top, you will see tabs, just like you saw on our website. Family and students is the tab that you will go to. The parent school parent, excuse me, the power school parent access portal it is the portal where, where you will be able to gain access to your child's grades and any information that you need. The district's website is where I just took you. And also one last thing, if you want up-to-date information on Savannah Chatham County Public School System, they have a YouTube page. On this YouTube page, and you can find that on their website as well, you have the home button, you have videos, and then you have a playlist uh, of all the up-to-date information that you will need. We want you to support our school, and we have social media. And if you are a part of Facebook, we have this Facebook page and you plug in at PWES Pelicans and we also have a Twitter page at PWES PK2. So while we're in the virtual world at the beginning of the year, we're going to have virtual spirit weeks on Facebook. When we send out information, flyers letting you know about this virtual spirit week, guess what? You can take pictures of you and your child participating and put it on our Facebook page. We want everyone to participate virtually and have fun posting on social media. 
so I want to say to you today, thanks so much for paying close attention to how to contact us. Again, I'm Dr. Boyd. I'm the new assistant principal here at Port Wentworth Elementary School, home of the Pelicans, where we show pride and commitment to all of our stakeholders. And that includes our wonderful families and our wonderful staff. Greetings, Pelican parents. It's Ms. Parker, your family engagement contact. I hope all is well and everyone is remaining safe. With that being said, until it is safe to be face-to-face, -face, we want to ensure that we provide our families and our students with the tools needed to be successful. We have created a virtual family resource center that's just one click away. You can access this virtual family resource center through a link provided on our social media platforms, our school website, and through our principal's Dr. Collins weekly newsletters. Can't wait to hear more? Let's take a tour. Hey Pelicans, it's Ms. Parker here getting ready to take you on this tour, right, of our virtual family resource center. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and present this to you really quickly. And as you can see, this is what you are going to see when you click on the link provided. This is the lobby or the homepage. You have a math room, science room, reading room, a social studies room, and um, a parent room and a interactive like game room. Just about every room has icons or items that you can click on. They are, everything in the room is just about clickable, which means that when you click on it, it's going to take you to an interactive site or a resource, okay? So just to show you really quickly, um, all of our platforms that we are using for the year, for instance, iReady on this laptop, Seesaw will take you to those sites. Our student handbook for 2020-2021 is right here. You can access it. Our Facebook page, our Twitter page, um, the Georgia Department of Education's page, our school website, and the district's page is here for you. If you click on the rug, if you click on anything just about on in this virtual resource center, it's going to take you to a very valuable resource. Once you get out of that, once you close that site, um, and you want to come back to the home page, just click on Ms. Parker and it'll take you back to the home page. So I'm going to show you just two examples. I'm going to click on the social studies page. Here you have valuable resources. If you click on one of those resources, it's going to take you to a link. And when you click on that link, for instance, I'm going to click on Mr. Nussbaum. It's going to take me to a website with lots of interactive resources. Here I have this particular website, actually guys, has not just social studies resources, but it also has math, language arts, history, science, holidays, um, lots of different subjects to be on social studies. So I love that about this. I'm done here. I've looked at all that I need to look at. I close out of it and it takes me right back to the social studies page. And then I click on me and boom, I'm back to the main page, the home page. One more thing, I'm going to click on the flower pot and this is the parent center, right? This is the parents room. This is going to be where we will keep updated any workshops or virtual um, events that we're going to have for our parents, any um, parent workshops or events that we're gonna have. We're gonna keep that updated here. You'll know about it here. Um, as you can see, we have pictures here from our past family engagement events. So always check out this page to see what's going on and how we're going to creatively keep you engaged. Click on me, takes you back to the home page. I hope you have an opportunity. Um, take advantage, please, parents, of this site, of this resource center. It has been specially created for you as um, I put you in mind, I put the parent, the students in mind when we created this um, because we know that it's important that you have lots of resources at your disposal so that you can best help the students um, because they're not in the classroom. And 
it takes all of us. We all take a part in helping our students be the best that they can be. So again, enjoy this virtual resource center. If you have any questions, by all means, there will also be in that parent center an opportunity for you to leave suggestions and feedback. So definitely do that so we can always look for ways um, to be better at what we do. Until next time, until it is safe to be face to face, let's continue to be great, all right? Thank you so much. I hope you've enjoyed this tour. Have a great rest of the day and we look forward to a great school year. Thank you. Pelican families, I hope that all the information shared in this video was helpful. Remember, if you continue to have questions, don't hesitate to call us here at the school. 912-395-6742 and we'll be happy to assist you. And we are looking forward to this uncharted waters that we are about to embark on with virtual learning.